This is the Qinghai Hu in China, a lake on the roof of the world. High in the mountains of Tibet is one of the holiest sites in Buddhism, a lake known as Gun Pao Zhao in Tibetan, as Kokono in Mongolian, and Qinghai Hu in Chinese. In all three languages, the name means the Blue Lake. The Qinghai Hu Lake is in the northeast of the vast elevated Tibetan Plateau, sometimes known as the Roof of the World. The lake is about 3,200 meters above sea level and is the largest lake in China. It would take more than 15 days to walk all the way around it. In the middle of the Qinghai Hu is a mysterious island called Haix in Chandao that is not even marked on most maps. It can only be reached by boat, and it is said that no foreigner has ever been to the island. Haix in Chandao means mountain in the heart of the lake. And this is the second part of the legend of the overflowed fountain. The lotus born, the founder of Tibet Buddhism, is said to have cut off a huge mountain in India and to have sealed the well with it. This mountain is the island Haix in Chandao, one of the holiest sites of Tibetan people and more sacred even than the lake itself. person is allowed on the island. That is why there are countless rumors of what the island looks like, who lives there, and what exactly goes on there. There is not a single photo of the island available anywhere on the internet. This is the first time the island has been filmed, the holy mountain in the heart of the lake. The truth behind life on the island is that it accommodates the Lotus Monastery, a Buddhist nunnery where girls and young women devote their lives to meditation and are given religious instruction far away from civilization. As a rule, the nuns wish to remain undisturbed by the outside world. They've made an exception for the first time for the making of this film, because the film also deals with the spiritual meaning of their sacred lake. In Tibetan society, nuns are not granted the same rank as male clergy. Thank you. 
This is something that the spiritual leader of the nuns would like to change. This is her, Chosnia de Bangmo. She calls herself a teacher, and she is convinced that the island is protected by an especially important deity, Jetsun Tara, the mother of all Buddhas. They say that the spirit of Jetsun Tara is living in the Qinghai Lake. This is why the Qinghai Lake is very precious. The center of the lake is the center of the world. The holy mountain, the most sacred mountain in the world, has its peak in the center of the lake. If you meditate at such a holy place, all living things are granted comfort and happiness. That is our faith. That is why we meditate here and thus protect this holy place. that these are not just the first, but for now, also the last images of the sacred island in Qinghai Hu. the mountain in the heart of the lake. Some faithful live at the foot of the monastery as hermits for months in simple burrows in order to benefit from the island's unique karma. In winter, they walk over the frozen lake and stay until the following winter, as did this hermit from the Tibetan capital, Lhasa. Many Tibetan believers, including the spiritual leader of the monastery, worship the Qinghai Lake with a very special conviction. They believe that the secret forces of this lake influence the fate of all people far beyond Tibet. The spirit of Jetsun Tara has a special significance in Buddhism. Big power comes from the soul of Jetsun Tara. It is said that not only the Tibetans and the Indians, not only Buddhists, that the entire world will be fulfilled with peace and happiness as long as the Qing High Lake exists. And this is what we believe.